RuPaul's Drag Race is the definition of binge-worthy television. If at some point since the show's 2009 debut you haven't found yourself glued to your screen watching these divas duke it out, do you even love reality TV? It's hard to pinpoint just one thing that draws fans to the show, because there's just so much to love. The competition aspect of it is eminently watchable, of course, but there's also the glitz and the glamour of the queens themselves. RuPaul's Drag Race has helped many drag performers make a name for themselves, but how much has that paid off in terms of dollars? Unsurprisingly, there are a number of wealthy stars whose careers reached new levels after competing on Drag Race, but the richest contestants of all may come as quite a surprise. Take Shangela, for example, who is reportedly worth $1 million. This might not sound like a lot of money by celebrity standards, but it's nothing to sneeze at either. Shangela appeared on season two of Drag Race coming in last, and in season three coming in sixth. Shangela also made an appearance on the third season of RuPaul's Drag Race All Stars. Outside of the RuPaul sphere, Shangela has racked up a number of television credits and most notably appeared alongside Lady Gaga in the 2018 film A Star Is Born. In an interview with In the Nose We Should Talk podcast, Shangela opened up about the importance of RuPaul's Drag Race, calling it an amazing platform for promoting drag. It gives us, you know, this great opportunity, but also the biggest winner of all is the community and the mm. existence of drag. Meanwhile, Cher impersonator Chad Michaels is one of the richest contestants to appear on Drag Race, with a reported net worth of $3 million. While he didn't win the competition when he appeared in season four, he did come in second, and later took the crown on the first season of Drag Race All-Stars. Michaels was already making waves as a drag queen before Drag Race, but told Socialite Life that appearing on the show gave his career a major boost. He said, It was really the first time I have been offered a hand up in this business, and I took it with a firm grip and gratitude. Bianca Del Rio won big on season six of Drag Race, coming away as the season's winner. It's no surprise then that she's also one of the richest contestants from the show, with an estimated fortune of $4 million. Del Rio parlayed a mean girl routine on the show into a successful stand up career, and has since become a brand unto herself. Before achieving fame, though, Del Rio was a costume designer, she once told Fast Company. It kind of snowballed. I didn't plan to be a comedian. I didn't plan to be a drag queen. It just kind of evolved. Del Rio also has a successful film and television career, starring on the TV show Bianca Del Rio's Really Queen and the feature film Hurricane Bianca. And then there's Trixie Mattel, one of the biggest names in drag and one of the richest. While placing only sixth on season seven of Drag Race, Mattel ended up winning the whole enchilada on season three of All Stars. Her career as a reality competition winning drag queen and a cosmetics queen has earned her a supposed net worth of $10 million. She has also appeared on TV for other shows, as well as music videos for her own music and those of other stars such as Iggy Azalea. Trixie Mattel acquired her fortune through a whole heap of hard work, telling The Guardian that she doesn't even take weekends off. In fact, they frustrate her because everyone stops working. Not her, though. To Mattel, every day is a Monday. But what about RuPaul himself? Arguably the most famous drag queen of all time, the TV star has a fortune estimated at a jaw-dropping $60 million. Enjoying a stellar career long before Drag Race, the show nonetheless propelled RuPaul to new heights. And the key to his success? Adaptability. As he once told NPR, the strongest power that each of us holds is our ability to adapt. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more list videos about the latest hot topics are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.